All right, there is a new place to enjoy a little bit of food and drinks in Lincoln. Julissa Ortiz live this morning at Oliver's Brew House and Grill to check it out. Hey, who? Hey, good morning to you. Yes, I've got the whole place to myself this morning. They literally just opened up. It is so fantastic. Quite fabulous, you guys, and plenty of space for all of us. So here's a road trip. This is going to be on our list of where we need to have a little meal together. I want to introduce you to the man in charge here. This is Matthew. Good morning to you. Good morning. Thank Hi. you guys for coming out. Oh, my gosh. This place is gorgeous. First of all, what I love is there's so much history in this building. We're only on the first floor, you guys. It's three stories. What, this is a 175-year-old building? Yeah, 175 years old. Wow. A lot of history, yeah. and you can feel it everywhere you go. <laughs> <laughs> in the walls it's amazing it is amazing okay let's take a little tour around so this is the first floor all right and this is so this is the brew house yeah so we partnered with big sexy brewing from sacramento i love that name by the way yeah well you know it's <laughs> apropos and they are coming out and they're brewing our beer so we have oliver's brew we have big sexy brew but we do everything craft cocktails yeah. amazing whiskey selection and of course Delicious food. I mean, hello. He had me at hello. All right, speaking of food, let's go right over here. I know the chef has been busy all morning long. Oh, look, there's several plates here. All right, so you kind of do, you do lunch and dinner, right? So talk a little bit about what we have yeah, here. Yeah, so we're open uh, Tuesday through Sunday. We yeah. open at 1130 for lunch. We are big into the brew house okay. being, yeah. you know, standard classic fish and chips made with those big steak fries. I mean, this is ginormous. G yeah. <laughs> and this fish is fresh 24 hours from caught to deliver here. We have a pastry chef that is making some of the most delicious pastries that you've ever experienced. Did you, Tina, are you looking at this right here? Oh. <laughs> wow. Yeah, and then our burgers, we bring in our own ground beef that is our own mix. Uh -huh. Delicious, big, juicy. And then, of course, we have a wood fire oven. And executive chef Darby here is uh, making some pizzas right now, throwing them in. We have all sorts of delicious, fresh made, and we make our own dough. So oh you gosh. taste the difference at Oliver's in Lincoln. Oh, my gosh. This is so fantastic. They're right in downtown, you guys. You can't miss it. Again, all of this, all the goodness. And I see him steering up some steak over there. I mean, oh, my gosh. So what have these last couple of days been like? You guys opened up on Tuesday. I know people are excited to get out. Yeah, it's been awesome. The city of Lincoln, Placer County, has been so supportive. And what they're really excited for is everything that we're doing, concerts, yeah. comedy, line dancing. We have our whiskey bar. And then, of course, the big thing is our Antler Steakhouse, oh which gosh. is getting ready to open in July. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so I'm going to take you over here, you guys, to the uh, stairs because you saw this little red rope. He mentioned the steakhouse, the ballroom, right? Because, Tina, I know you like to line dance. Look at this. Help! We're going to go beyond the red rope. <laughs> We're going to go beyond the red rope, take you upstairs because there's a whole new restaurant up there, another bar, and a members only lounge. But you know me. You know I'm going to sneak myself into that members only, even if I'm not a member, okay? <laughs> You got to come check them out there. Oliver's here in Lincoln. They just opened up and they're right in downtown. I'll send it back over to you. Hulisa, we know how you roll. You make yourself a member. That's how it works. Right? <laughs> just walk through with confidence. They'll never stop you. All right, uh, Hulisa, thank you very much. Appreciate that.